Hey guys, good morning. Guess what? Happy Friday. Woohoo! For those of you who are new, my name is Cricket. This is Cricket's Coffee. Let's get started. Um, since it's the day before payday here, I want to talk to you about finances a little bit. Um, uh, we all struggle at times and everything, and, and uh, I have to do ours by budget. So I... Um, I kind of do it for the year budget book. So I kind of have it. I have it dated. This is this week's, but you can't actually see what it, but I've got it all right now, broken down. And um, I do that every fortnight. I sometimes can almost do it for the year. But the big thing is you got to live within your means to accomplish you know what whatever and and we do that here we um we don't go out alive um i can't tell you the last time we went to the cinema was to see greatest showman i think that's been that's how long it's been um we usually go for my birthday but we didn't get to go this year uh, uh when we have to pay bills we have something here with direct we call direct debits so we have a separate account um, just for our direct debit. So anytime we need to to use a bill doing that, we'll put the money in there and just take it, basically drop it and forget it. Um, I do split up the payments when I can. It makes it easier on the budget and a um, little bit more flexibility that way. Um, we pay the uh, electric bill and the phone bill by what's called Senny Pay. So we haven't taken out. Phil and I are both on pensions. So we just basically take it out and forget it. We'll, we'll, we'll pay the extra as needed, which is what we're doing right now. Um, yeah, I have a credit card, but I don't use it at the moment because I have the new credit card. They got into, you know, got into trouble with it. So we're working on it. I called the bank. That's the one big thing people don't do is... Don't be afraid to call the bank and go, look, I need some help. Um, and that's what I've been, that's what I did with the credit card. It's like, I can give you two options. You can either close it off, don't have to worry about it anymore, or you can, you know, you can, we'll figure this out. I said, I'm not losing this fight. So um, it's been good. I've been able to to pay on it, you know, every fortnight, Um that's one payment I just pop in the direct, you know, pop it directly on the credit card. And here in, I think, July, we'll be back up to where we need to be, and I'll start building on what I've got going. And But it, they've been really supportive about that and encouraged me to keep going, and, and they've been really helpful. Um, Savings accounts, I have a few. We have a few, but they're lab they're labeled for different things. I have my own. Phil has his own. Um, we have one for Disney World where we'll put a couple dollars in every fortnight once some bills get paid and things, and we'll increase that. But that's how we'll go to Disney World here in a few years, and just by saving up. And when we can go cruising again, we have a cruise account. And I can set it up here to where I can make deposits but I have to call them to make withdrawals so that makes it a little harder on for me but we do that with travel like when we went on our cruise last year we put things on the travel card and that kind of kept everything separate and it, it's you would look at it and go that's a little much but it's what works for us so we don't go to movies We've got the movie channel here. We've got the sports package. Um, with Phil's health challenges, uh, we're, we're homebodies at times. And so that's why the movies, channels, and different things. So we still get to, you know, get to go out and stuff. Uh, it's living on a limited you know, budget is hard, but it's only as hard as you make it. And I know that sounds a little strange, but we got ourselves, dug ourselves a little bit of a hole where the phone bill is concerned, but we've worked with them, got ourselves back out, we're almost caught up, and we're still going strong, and I'm due for a new phone at the end of 
uh, November, but I know, I know exactly what I want. I've already, you know, I'll go in and go, this is exactly what I want and keep it under where, hopefully where we are now. And that'll save us, you know, a little bit more here and there. Uh, I know finances, is, finances used to just drive me insane. And now I've got the banking set up to where, um, by the time I get up Saturday morning, it's all done. I've scheduled it all to move around on its own. And with the colder weather, it's, uh, Phil had trouble yesterday. So we needed to, uh, I needed to, we don't get up right away. So it's just too cold for him. Um, yeah, I use the, I use the savings accounts as positives, you know, saving up for something. I've done that, put a couple of dollars away or whatever. Figured up the payment in a couple of months. I've been able to, you know, you split it up and give yourself little goals and things. I think that's the big thing with finances. You have to set yourself baby steps. Uh, and you get to that first baby step. Oh, wait, wow, wow, I did that. Well, this is my next baby step. Um, and, and, you know, we have med medication we have to order and, and we make sure that gets done and, and everything. So we're having to do a little extra car repair. So, um, anyway, I know it's a short one today. Um, but just, yeah, take time with those finances and, and things and you guys will be okay. And remember, it's Friday. And if you're struggling, hang in there. It will get better. I'm, I'm Cricket. This is Cricket's Coffee. Have a good one.